gonna show the whole world what we're all about. We the girls with a passion for fashion. Ooh, we're rats. We'll always be there for each other. Ooh, we're rats. Yeah. Styling how we feel. Ooh, talking about best friends. Yeah. Together we can do anything. We all gotta plan the dream. Take a chance and believe. Make it real. Rats. <laughs> Some article on models with brains. Thanks, Kim. And the article on modeling school ripoffs saved me some major cash. Thanks, guys. Hello, this is Yasmin. Uh huh. You girls want to catch the new slasher movie with us? Ooh, <laughs> too scary. Uh, no way. Seen it. That was London Milton's agent. The London Milton? As an heir to the Milton billions? Yeah, she liked my portrayal of supermodels in my article and wants me to interview her for the magazine. Whoa, London is so hot. She's on the cover of every major magazine. And for doing nothing but having a zillion dollars and bad hair extensions. Exactly, her only talent is knowing which parties to show up at. The last thing I want to do is interview some spoiled rich girl. There's no story there. How's this story? Bratz Magazine profiles now girl of the decade. Sales skyrocket. Oh, come on, pretty princess. Do it for the magazine. Pretty, please? Yeah, right. You're an idiot. Listen to me, you no-talent brainless hack. You get me an interview with your client, London Milton, or you'll never work in this town again. London Milton's useless agent has obviously banned her from talking to the press. Really? Because Bratz Magazine has an interview with her. Yeah. What? She said, really? Because Bratz... I heard her, you moronic minion. How dare those brats try to outscoop us again. Oh, mother of pink. I want you two to track down London immediately. Once she finds out your thing wants her, she'll forget all about that crummy little Bratz Magazine. Track her down? How? Here, take my car and follow those brats. Find them and you'll find London. And don't even think of coming back without that interview. Chop, chop. Do you think we should tell Berdine that we failed driver's ed? Yeah. Wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. <laughs> Maybe if I drove, we would actually get somewhere. Now get out and check the brake lights. What? Just do it. London's a flake. She's not even here. I can't believe this. Oh, pretty princess. She's only five minutes late. Give her a chance. Angel's right. You're a journalist. Keep your mind open. Let me, let me, let me see. Quit it. There's London. Okay, finally she's here. I can't believe she brought her limo and bodyguards. It's my turn. Shut up. It's my turn. Oh, <laughs> 
Hey, get your hands off of me! Hey, you guys, something's wrong. Hey, you! Stop! Yes? Talk to us! Hey, let go of her! <laughs> so you want to go for a ride, too? Pretty princess, what's going on? Hey, they're getting into the car. We gotta follow them. Follow that car. Aw, hey, I wanted to say that line. Pretty princess, Jasmine, can you hear me? Answer me, please, Jasmine. London's agent. Chloe, what's with the polishing? Uh, I can't help it. I don't know what else to do. Whenever I totally freak, I polish. Oh, poor Yasmin, what if she's been kidnapped and taken away to a mysterious location and held for ransom and... Angel, get a grip! You've seen too many reality shows. Right. Okay. Move it! Hey, jerk! <laughs> Now stay there! Uh. Quit shoving me! You almost made me break a nail. You're like the worst driver ever. Just park it. Okay, Kirstie, now what? Casey, why are we still, like, moving? Oops, I always forget to put it in park. Ah! Do you think Birdnose will notice? Watch him while I call her parents with a ransom demand. <laughs> this should be as easy as ordering fast food. <laughs> this better not take long. I have a hot party to go to, you know. Oh! <sighs> Hey, I'm into yoga breathing, too. <gasps> hey, Luke, you look really stressed. You should get into yoga. Yeah, what do you think this is, a spa? Now shut up! Um... London's agent says as far as she knows, London is fine. The police say to call back in two hours. What should we do? People, it's time to get proactive here. Let's check out the restaurant. Hey, Angel, you okay to stay here in case Jasmine shows up? Sure, I'm fine. I am so not fine. The hostess said both London and Yasmin were no-shows. Look! Yasmin's cell phone! Oh, this is bad. Yas doesn't just lose things. Check out the footprints. Something definitely went down. Oh, I really love Bratz Magazine, but I just wish that you guys did more makeovers. You know, like the right eyeshadow and eyeliner can totally change your whole life. Yeah, thanks. I'll suggest we do a whole issue devoted to eye makeup in our next editorial meeting. Hot. Hey, Yasmin, what'd you do to make over Luke? She is kidding, right? I mean, he could be really cute. He's already got a great bod. <laughs> She's not kidding. Hey, tough guys don't do cute. Well, first I'd start with his clothes. Way too much black. It makes his face look sickly. Shut up. Really? Possibly be on Bowery Street. My 
interns took it to interview now girl London Milton. Yes, that's my license plate number. <laughs> Return it at once. I don't care if it's not your job. <sighs> oh. Pink cab. This is Burdine Maxwell, founder, president, and editor-in-chief of Your Thing magazine, and the... Angel, any news? The Tweevils left Burdine's car on Bowery Street, and they were with London Milton. We're there. I can't believe Yasmin would interview London in such a dump. That's a brats for you. Keep it down, dipwad! You want them to hear us? Ow! My nose! And a trendy new haircut. One that frames your face better. Yeah, that's what Francois, my hairstylist, said. You also need to act more relaxed and confident. Women really like that in a guy. Well, it's kind of hard to be relaxed in my line of work. Oh, well, you should really check out yoga. Here, try the tree position. Huh. Uh, oh. Uh, I'll use my shoulder for balance. <laughs> oh. Whoa, London! Where did you learn that? Eris Kidnapping Survival School? Oh, oh. Quick, let's get out of here before he comes to. Ah! My car! Oh, those idiot interns of mine will pay for this. <laughs> Mother of Pink, I forgot my spare keys. <gasps> Look, there's Bertine's car! How many times have I told you, Luke? Hostages can't be trusted. Oh. I'm sorry, but she took a cheap shot. You girls try anything again, and you're going to feel pain like you've never felt before. Got it? He's like such a manly man. Uh, totally. I'm gonna pick up the ransom money. If they don't behave, give them the special treatment. Give them a facial with this. Got it. So, like, how about an interview for Your Thing magazine? Your Thing? <laughs> Sorry. I don't talk to magazines that do articles on how to blow your nose after a nose job. Oh, that was my idea. Hey, how much do you get for allowance? Uh, $50 a week. <laughs> That's it? <laughs> we get 60. So, like, how can you afford your mega-rich lifestyle? Uh, it's like so not like mega rich. The parties I go to are free. So are the museums and the libraries. You go to libraries? Yeah, I love to read, uh, especially mysteries. Wow, so do I. Like, what do your parents do anyway? They own a hotel chain and do charity work. Well, our father's a doctor. Uh, yeah, a podiatry. And our mother's vice president of Women Against Change. Uh, yeah. yeah. Angel, what's up? Sasha, London's agent just called. London's been kidnapped. They're demanding a ransom, and Yasmin's with her. <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh no! London's parents have agreed to pay the five million dollars. I'm so scared. What if something goes wrong? What if they keep the money and Yasmin? She'll be all alone and lost in the world. And what if they hurt her? Oh, Sasha, I have no time for this. Don't worry, Angel. We'll find them. Oh, guys, please be careful. Where on earth are those imbecile interns? Hey, that was probably like really important. Yeah, like a free offer for long distance service. Uh, yeah. Would you stop with the, uh, yeah, already? 
giving me a headache. Yeah. Verdine, have you seen Yasmin or London Milton? Oh, please. Like, I'd know where Yasmin is. Listen, London and Yasmin have been kidnapped. If Casey and Kirsty followed them, they could be in serious trouble. You bet they're in serious trouble. Look what they did to my car. Come on, Sasha, let's go. Hey, brats, get back here. I need a ride into town. And our dad doesn't even pay income tax. Yeah. Huh? That's it. I can't take it anymore. I gotta shut you two up. Give me your scarf. What do you think you're doing? Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, that hurts. Uh, I am going to report you for kid number brutality. Shut up. I need some tape. Uh, I have some tape for my nose job in my bag. Ow. Hey, get your grubby hands out of there. That's like a real imitation leather, you know. It costs 200 bucks. <gasps> a brass magazine? You traitor. Verdine's going to feed you to the shredder. Thank you. <gasps> Look! Footprints! Look! Yasmin's notebook! They must be inside this building. Let's get the police here now! Oh my gosh! Poor Yasmin in London! What if those evil kidnappers sneak them out of the country in oil drums and sell them to sweatshops? After which they'll be reduced to a life of begging on some dusty street in the middle of a war zone! <laughs> This Chloe chick gives good advice. I want to be a writer one day. Oh, that's hot. I've been studying journalism at college. Really? I didn't know that. A lot of people don't. They think all I do is go to parties and smile for the camera, but I have so many other passions. Of course, no one ever writes about those. I'll write about them. That's what I thought, just like you did with those supermodels. See, that's why I want you to interview me. I mean, if we ever get out of here. London, I'm really scared. So am I, Yasmin, but we'll get through this together. Luke, the cops are coming. Grab them and let's move. Anything we want to do, we're going to do it right. <laughs> Always going to win because we don't give up the fight. <laughs> Never gonna slow us down, no, because we know that Graduate of the Heiress Kidnapping Survival School. I'm like so over this gross room. Hello, hello, we're like still here. Somebody get us out of here. What do you mean you won't send a cab to this neighborhood? Do you know who I am? Verdine Maxwell, founder. What? You do know who I am? Try, Chloe. Wow! You're London Milton, hotel heiress and scorching party princess. I'm Dylan. At your service, your ravishing highness. Hey, Chloe, what's up? London was just showing us how to do a flying spin kick. <laughs> yeah, right. Why would a delicate little flower such as yourself need to know something like that? Mm, you never know. It may come in handy. Like we're pushy guys? Show them, London. Hi-ya! Oh no, I didn't mean to 
actually hit him. Um, are, are you okay? Maybe you should give him mouth to mouth. Actually, Cameron, you should give it to him. You just took CPR. Whoa! Full recovery. Um, you know what they say. Can't keep a good man down. <laughs> <laughs> so I once again learned that you really can't judge a book by its cover. And speaking of covers, our issue with Now Girl London Milton was another big hit for Bratz Magazine. Hi! -ya! <laughs>